Colorado has inspired countless musicians. Last night, one of them passed away. Jeff Austin died in Seattle after being put in a medically induced coma. He helped co-found the bluegrass jam band Yonder Mountain String Band. They got their start in Netherlands. Yeah, they went on to headline shows at Red Rocks and even their own music festival. Tonight, we caught up with a bass player in Lyons who toured with Austin during his solo career. Would you like to do one? Uh, sure. All right. This is the Oscar Blues uh, Bluegrass Jam. It's been going on for just about 18 or 19 years, and uh, it was started by uh, Casey Groves and me. The, the bluegrass scene is constantly evolving, um, and it's really it's amazing that Colorado has found a place, I think, in the, uh, in the history of bluegrass. You know, uh, Jeff Austin, passed away today I uh, hear I think it was today eventually and um, so let's do a uh, let's do one Jeff um, oh my God. I think brought a cohort of his from Illinois and grabbed a couple other guys up in Nederland Colorado and formed uh, yonder mountain stream band. Well, we often lose some things in life that makes us wonder why well, that whole band has just been a had a huge impact on uh, broadening the audience for bluegrass music. Would cause my poor heart grief. Yeah, Jeff Austin. He was a friend and uh, and an employer for a small while. I've recorded two records with him, and uh, he uh, he was probably the most focused in the studio. Uh, I don't know. It hit me a lot. Uh, harder than I thought it would today. I hope they look up on my face and know I've done my best. Everybody! Anyway, we lost a, a big force in the Colorado bluegrass scene. Um, he uh, created quite a stir here. Many Coloradans missing a talented band tonight. Austin played with Yonder Mountain String Band until 2014. He left that band to pursue a solo career. He was 45.